Hello, this is Steven from OnlineAnalogs.com and in this tutorial we'll show you how to route your Galaxy S7 using CF Auto Route. This route method does not work on the USA versions that have a locked bootloader. First of all, you have to enable developer options on your phone by tapping seven times on the build number. Then from developer options, have to enable OAM Unlock. This basically unlocks the bootloader and afterwards also enable USB debugging. After this is set up, can turn off the phone in order to put it in download mode. To get it in download mode, you need to hold in the same time home power and volume down till you'll see a warning screen with two options. Here you have to press volume up to continue and you'll be in download mode. Once the phone is set up, can uh, get back to the computer where you need to download the CF Auto Root Pack. You'll find the link in our uh, written tutorial. Once this is downloaded, extract the files because it will not work properly if you just open Odin from inside the archive and select the CF Auto Root file. You should be able to use Windows Explorer to extract this or if it's easier just use any zip extractor. I recommend when opening Odin to run it as administrator to avoid any problems. The Odin that comes in the CF Auto Root Pack is a modified version that does not allow you to change any settings. Basically, you don't need anything changed, so why leave place for any mistake? Select the CF auto root file for the AP field and press start. That's it basically. Uh, on your phone, you should uh, see the flashing progress and after uh, that, it should reboot by itself. Be patient because uh, should reboot like two times and might take a bit more than five minutes so if it's taking longer than a normal boot no need to worry it's perfectly normal please wait till it turns on by itself even if you have any sort of problem because of the root and for example the phone is stuck on the boot logo it can be fixed easily by doing a full flash with the correct firmware we will uh, make a tutorial shortly about how to fix this and other software errors for the S7 after it's booted, you will see the SuperSue app on the phone and it should open without error, a good sign that the phone is rooted correctly. If you have any questions or problems, please leave a comment below. And if you want to unlock your Galaxy S7, please contact us on our website, onlineanalogs.com, and it will be our pleasure to help you.